Come on with it. Beautiful day for some ball, boys. Pingree took it. Pingree won the toss and will receive. Pingree took it. Pingree versus Dexter. Round two on the channel, guys. Let's go. Chase half to the up close. Screen all wide open for Carver. Takai. Tank. Oh. Huddy. First down, Pedro. Hudson Weidman scores. Hudson Weidman gets them on the board. Pass complete. Turn on Liam the Andrews on that tackle. Oh, tank. Oh. Tank. Oh, yeah, cut that in, boy. To Kai. There we all sit. Oh, they needed this one. They needed that one. Austin Hartzell. A 95-yard touchdown. Oh man. Jalen Richardson touchdown. Yeah. 
Huge tackle. Darius Day, touchdown. Oh, Darius Day picks it. Oh my God, Austin Hartzell. Weidman picks up the first on third and 19. With the sack. This is fourth down for the Highlanders. Oh, Makai who converted it. Wow, that was huge. There you go. This is fourth down and one. Pangry needs this. Tank. Gets in, Max Stereo. Oh, Bonsu. Takai Whitmore, next play. Takai Whitmore! Awesome. Got him Quarterback again. keeps Dom Sylvia meets him in the backfield. This is third and long for Pingree. They need this one, guys. Weidman. He's gonna take it. Wow, that was now it's fourth and three for Pingree. Three minutes. This field is getting loud. Weidman. Pass is complete for Terry but he's tackled immediately. No gain on the play. Texas no gain. Third and two. Oh! Fourth down. Guys, this is a huge play. Fourth down with 144 left. If Dexter gets this, it could be the game. I think they got it. That's good enough for a first down. They got the first. Fullback dive. That's gonna ice this one, guys. Oh, 
Let me let y'all know. I don't talk. I just finished business, man. That's what he Let's says. Go. Austin Hartzell, senior, balling out on senior day. Yes, sir. You know, where does that rank in terms of a game for you? Because that by was far the best. by far the best. By far. We came in every day, right? Put the work in, and it all pays off. So, excited. Can't wait to celebrate. Talk about the kick return. Because that, yeah. again, you guys needed that. That was yeah, big. Yeah, the blockers. I mean, they've been great all year. I saw a hole, I hit it, and I was gone. So, it was crazy. It was awesome. Awesome. You know, you scored down there. Um, you know, it was right after Day's pick. Talk about that as well. You know, that was a huge play for us. We knew we were going to take a shot on that kid. And I told him, throw it up, and I'm going to make a play for us. You know, so it's that simple. You know, you guys came out of a, a completely different team in the second half. What happened? Uh, we just came in and we just, you know, we just talked at, at halftime about how much this really means to us. And we came out and said, there's no way we lose on to, to this team again. So that's exactly uh, what we did. In Austin, like, what does it mean, though, to get a win over Pengree? Because that, that's a great yeah, it's a great rivalry. It means everything. It was a heartbreaker last year. You know, so we couldn't lose. We, we were not going to lose today. And we did it. So. Yeah, so senior year, you're wrapping up your career, brother. You know, just talk about what it's like, you know, to end on a W. You know, it's great. You know, I, I play high school football, you know, it's the best thing. The most I've had in my life, so I'm just grateful for everything. Thank you to Dexter and thank you to everyone. Yeah, you want to shout out your friends and family? Yeah, shout out my family, shout out my friends. Shout out everyone. <laughs> shout out recruiting more, baby. Let's go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know what it is, bro. Pretty River versus Craig. Big time game, big time player. I make big time play. Let's go, baby. 2024, Joe McCauley. Joe, just talk about this win. Oh, this is great. It's long overdue. We didn't forget last year. Sorry, my voice is out. <laughs> but fought a lot of adversity. We got 19, 10 and a half. Took a lot of took a lot of time to find a hearts in the locker room. The other thing, we came out on top. First time forever. We'll never forget that. What was the message at the half? Because, you know, you guys were down, and they came out um, excited, and, you know, talk about it. Really at half, we were just talking about, like, we gave him, like, way too many chances. Penguins quarterback, great player, breaking a lot of tackles. He did this thing, but we made sure we wrapped up, and we got stopped, scored the ball. That's what we needed to do. We just played our game, and that's how we won. Joe, what did you do differently in the second half? Because I just felt like you came out firing. Um... We just wanted to play aggressive. We played from behind. I feel like we played a little passive at first, but it happens big game. They're making a lot of plays. We just need to do our thing. We just want to play aggressive, push the ball downfield, and make some plays. Big time game. You have to do it. You know, a great rivalry. Yeah. This never, you know, this never is boring. We came in here expecting dog fight next time. That's a great team, great program. They take us to the wire every time. Tomorrow we're going to put it behind us and focus on our next team. You want to shout out your friends and family, hey, Joe? Shout out my friends family. They all showed up. Shout out RB. Man, Takai, what a way to end your senior year. Big game, big game. Talk about it, because, you know, we talked about this back in July. It lived up to it. I know. We've been taking it one week at a time, but, you know. You guys are you, to, man. You guys, are, you guys are trying to overlook back to it, but we know, like, coming into the year, this was the biggest game of us, biggest rivalry. You know, we came up short the past few years. Last year, we had we lost in a heartbreaker. So, you know, we kind of, we wanted this one bad. This means a lot. You know, I think we secured the bowl, bowl game. So, hopefully, you know, moving on to next week. We haven't lost on main field in a long time. So, couldn't go out today like that. Takai, what do you think was the difference in between the two halves? Because you came out a completely different team. First half, we was kind of hanging our heads a little bit. We would make a mistake and kind of, like, dwell on it. But second half, we kind of came out with different intensity. You know, kind of one play at a time. You know, all it takes is one play. Boom, back in the game. Scored probably first or second play in the half. Got right back into it, got the momentum. The energy shifted, you know, energy in the locker room. We kind of knew it had, it had to be done, so. Talk about your role on this team. You got the game dagger, you mm -hmm. know, down there. But last year, did you even play offense? No, nah, I didn't play offense. Uh, we lost a, we lost a good running back. So, you know, kind of just uh, as a leader on the team, I stepped up. You know, I played running back back in the day. So, I got I got a couple moves in me. But, you know, just kind of being a team player, you know, whatever the team needs, you know, I'm down to do it. You know, I'm going to college to play corner. But both sides of the ball, you know, I'm going to play my heart up. A huge play was when Darius got the pick. Yeah. And then, yeah, that was huge. That was huge. Yeah, do you think that was a game-changing play? Definitely. Honestly, the play, when he scored the touchdown before the pick, was a game changer. You know, we got back into the game, and then that pick kind of gave us all the momentum we needed to, to you know, go forth. So.
Right, and then just talk about this rivalry because, you know, it was a chippy one, but at the same time, I feel like that's, you know, you guys got respect uh, and yeah, stuff. Yeah, but. No, I, all, off the field, you know, it's a lot of respect for the guys. You know, kind of just a, a lot of emotions with this game. It's kind of like a school thing just coming into Dexter. I was kind of emphasized, like, the, you know, that uh, Dexter versus Pingree rivalry in all sports. So, you know, it was kind of kind of adapted to me. Came in sophomore year and kind of told me, like, what the rivalry was. Last year, I felt it. I didn't really play play them again uh, before that, so you know I was kind of new to it. But like this year, it was personal for me. Takai, you want to talk about your Bucknell commitment? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, really excited about that. You know, I love the coaching staff, the team, uh, the defensive guys. And, uh, everything's perfect about it. Uh, academically, great, great fit for me. And I'll be back out there on my official in December. So looking forward to that. You know, go Bison. Absolutely. You want to shout out your friends and family? Uh, yeah, shout out to my mom, my dad my aunts, uncles, my grandmother, everybody, all the people that's been supporting me, my friends, everyone that came out to see me on uh, senior night, you know, it means a lot, but uh, shout out recruit board too. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, Coach Day. That was a great one. It lived up to every ounce of expectation, I feel. Just talk about it. Yeah, I'm um, really proud of our guys. You know, I think really, obviously, I got all the respect in the world for Coach Day and his program. <laughs> I got a lot of uh, all the respect in the world for Coach Flynn and his program, and obviously we've been on the short side of it the last three years, so to come out on the other side feels good. Right, and then what was the difference in between the two halves? Because, you know, you guys came out and – I want to say angry, what's the word, or well, composed? Yeah, we, we got a veteran locker room, and we've been in these things before, and we're a confident team, and I think, you know, we're, we've been a second-half team all year. I think, you know, we, we run around, and we got some big guys that wear, you know, can wear on you a little bit, and I think coming in at halftime, I think definitely a little bit of an edge coming out of the locker room. You want to talk about Austin's play today? I feel like he stepped up on senior Austin's, day. I mean, he's, 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 first of all, probably one of the greatest teammates we've ever had at, the, at this, in this program. Going to BC to play baseball, decided to, to come out and start playing football again at his last school he had stopped playing. I mean, he's a tremendous, tremendous athlete. I mean, he can, he can basically do everything on the football field. That he, that, you know, he, can, he can throw the ball, catch the ball. He holds for us. He, he can do it all. And like you saw today, you know, he's been inches away from breaking, breaking kickoff returns all year, and today he got it done for us. Yeah, and then what would you say, you know, was the message at practice this week? Because obviously after a heartbreaker last year, yeah. they don't forget about that. We talk about going 1-0 and every week. We just talk about how, you know, what had happened in the past, whether it's last week, last year, two years ago, really had no effect on what was going to happen today. So positive, you know, throughout the week, we had a great week of practice, and maybe we'll come out with a win. Yeah, and then just talk about the senior class. Our seniors are, I mean, we had great senior speeches the other night. I mean, it's like the level of character and, and in leadership in, in that group is tremendous, and, you know, they're, they're great kids. You know, we have 10 seniors, and, and you know, I couldn't be happier with the senior class. Yeah. Next week's bowl season, Coach. You'll enjoy this one, but yeah. then how is that decided, even who you play? Well, I'm actually with a committee. I'm on part of the committee, so there's no automatic bids or anything like that. But I you know, feel pretty good that we're going to get get a get a bid. There's eight bowls this year, so you know, ten in the morning tomorrow we'll find out. You know, we'll meet and find out what the match is. So uh, I don't know if you heard, but uh, BB and N won. So, oh my God, Mike Willie. All let's, right, that's great news. I want to see a BB and N Dexter game. <laughs> <laughs> Good for him. Uh, that's fantastic. So I'm sure we'll be on a phone call later. Mike and I talk quite often, so that, that's how we <laughs> Yeah. All right. Thank you, Coach. All right, thanks.